Hi guys, it's Mama Bear here and I'm coming to you with another YouTube video on the Civcraft server. Um, today Wasabi and I are going to have a look at the building called the Mob Spawner and uh, basically we are not 100% sure how this is going to work. Okay, so uh, Mini built this building. I do understand that only the owner of the building can actually um, do anything uh, or, or actually spawn mobs or something. I'm, I'm not 100% sure on that. So let's um, see what's in the chest. I um, might just eat something just in case something decides to come out. Okay, so mob level 2, place required, items to level up. Uh, spawn rate every 30 seconds. Um, every 30 sec, maybe. Um, I could actually upgrade um, <laughs> Wasabi with a countdown. Uh, cool. So I think maybe if we upgrade the beakers, it might help a bit more <laughs> Wasabi lives to sleep. But just let's just make sure these doors are shut because if uh, something spawns, man, I don't want to. I don't want to die straight away. So while we're waiting for these mobs to spawn and Sabi to come running back, um, no more beakers. Um. Maybe Minnie still ha uh, Mama still has one. Hang on. Okay, so let's see. Uh, upgrade 80. Level 3. Upgrade 260. Um, and like that, he's gone. Uh, okay, so eight spawn count eight max entities forty every thirty seconds. Mm. Well, does it only work at night time? And he's back. Let's lock him in. Uh. Okay, so according to the uh, wiki, um, the mob grinder is a one by one building, so it only takes up one chunk. Uh, you do need to um, research mysticism uh, before you are able to actually build the building, plus you have to actually be a noble. So you have to actually uh, have a citizen level of at least noble one in order to um, be able to build the building. Uh, the other thing is, is that it's going to cost you about 500 hammers to build. And um, cost you about 500 coins a day. So the mob grinder is a structure that basically spawns a mob when a player was in within a few blocks of it. Um, and it will go to sleep. Oh, for 10 minutes. Okay, so okay, so we need to wait about 10 minutes before it starts, and then um, it will start spawning. I think we've got 40 mobs. Um, Max entities, 40, spawn count 8. Uh, every 30 seconds, we're going to get anywhere between 8 and 40, I'm thinking. Something along those lines. Um, and then we can kill them. Um, and if you also leave the chunks, so... Um, <laughs> um, so if we leave the chunk during this time, it will reset for 10 minutes. Um, so if there's an issue, we need to do sieve restart. Spot. Let's just do that. Sieve... Restart spawner. Okay. Oh no! Oh no! It's working! It's working! It's working! Working! Uh, get in there! <laughs> get in there! And there's slimes too! Get in there, I shut the door behind you. Oh, cool! Oh no, Creeper damaged me as well from outside. Um, slime, slime attack, slime attack. Sli hey, come on, getting the coins. More slimes! Oh my god! Oh my god! <laughs> this is kind of crazy. Oh no! Creeper damaged through the glass. Holy crap! 
Are you okay? Oh no, I think he needs help. I'm going in. Oh no! Oh no! Oh no! <laughs> oh no. Um, uh oh. Okay, so I think... Yes, I got stuck in a spider web. Alright, so I'm going to have to get some serious armor, people. Oh, wow, all the zombies are out. Okay, so this might need to be a double person attack. Did you get balls? Yes. Nice. Two. <laughs> Cools. Well, better than nothing. Okay. Oh no, I'm stuck in the spider web again. I'm stuck in the spider web again. Okay. So guys, this is a mob spawner. Um, so basically, uh, before 2.4.1, the mob spawner you actually used to only spawn mobs based on the um, biome that you were in, and now they've changed it so it does randomly spawn um, according to, well, it just randomly spawns um, various mobs, which is kind of cool because it means that you don't get stuck with one particular um type of mod which uh, or mob I should say um, so when you upgrade your grinder um, you will essentially increase the rate in which the um, mobs spawn um, it also will increase the um, the number of mobs that spawn per 30 seconds structure level one you will get five um, people spawning and then at structure level uh, 10, you'll get 14 spawning, but you'll only ever get a maximum number of items um, of mobs at a time. So in other words, um, on level one, you'll only get a maximum of 25 in a room at a time. And then at 10, you'll only get a maximum of 70. So leveling up will basically help you with being able to, um, to get all your mob stuff. So that's really cool. And also um, an interesting fun fact is that the mob spawner won't actually go up any higher than your culture level. So if you're only going culture level 7, for example, you cannot actually upgrade your mob spawner any more than level 7. Okay. How am I doing? Slime balls, we need a chest. Oh, jeez, he's good. Uh, let's put some potatoes in here as well. So let's just see how we go here for a little while. Whoa! Whoa! Did you just see that? Did you just see that? Hello? 
Okay guys, so I think I'm just going to actually record a little bit of this mob fun and uh, then we'll end the video there. So thanks for watching. Hope you're having a mob-tastic time. Did that... Was that Skelly just wearing a creeper head? Oh my god. That Skelly was wearing a creeper head. That was weird.